Hey guys, so if you haven't checked out my last video, go check out my last video if you want to know all the products that I just purchased. Um, but I'm just going to be unboxing a few of them and just trying to see how they are, give you my initial response to them and stuff like that. So let's just get started. So the first one I'm going to try out is this concealer. It's the Age Rewind. The little brush looks like a bunny's butt. Like a bunny tail. Turn collar of the micro corrector applicator and direction of arrows until product is visible on sponge. This may require a number of turns. Adjust accordingly for desired amount of product. Using app applicator, apply concealer directly to under eye area, blending in an outward motion. To apply more, twist collar of application one to two clicks at a time for best results. Use sparingly. I think it's coming out. I can see darkness coming out. Oh, I can see it. Look, that's so cool. I don't know how much I should use, but let's see. I think this is a good color for me. I did good with the concealer. So in general, I love the concealer. It looks really good and it's supposed to be a good treatment for your face. Um, so I'm excited about that. But the brush works fabulously. Um, and the concealer, it's not like, once you put it on, it doesn't feel cakey. It just feels like your normal skin. And obviously I would go over it with my powder that I would put over my foundation. You would do foundation, then concealer, then powder. The next thing that I really want to try is this brow pencil. This is the Salon Perfect Brow Pencil in the color Mink. Uh, quick and easy, include sharpener and brow brush. So, yeah. Let's see how easy it really is. Groom brows with brush to, des to desired shape. Define and fill in brows with pencil as needed. Blend pencil in with brush. I think I'm going to have to work on that a little bit more. I kind of like it, kind of not. I have to practice a little bit with it. I've never ever used a brow brush before and it makes my eyebrows look so much darker. And I don't need my eyebrows to look darker because my hair's lighter and I don't know what to do about that. The next thing that I'm going to try is this bronzer. I think I need to do a little bit more highlighting because I haven't I didn't highlight today at all so if I highlight more then it won't look like my face is weirdly shaped but I like this bronzer it's a very good color so try it out I'm gonna swatch this stuff for you Ooh! so there's two different looks here I'm gonna swatch this one first and then this one so these are the four colors for the first look it's the lightest this is the brow bone color this is the eyelid color, this is the crease color, and this is the accent color. So this is your outer V color. And I think this will create a pretty cool look. It's kind of a darker look. So, yeah, I can't wait to try it out. This is the darker look of the two. And this is the, like, the nighttime look. It's the shimmery look. So I'm going to swatch, oh my goodness, I'm going to swatch my, um, the other one so you guys can see. Okay, so these are the other ones. This is These are lighter colors. Um, this is a lighter look, darker look, obviously. Um, I'm going to try out both just so I can see, but this is the brow bone, the eyelid, the crease, and then the accent color. So, yeah, those are the swatches for you guys. And it tells you, you know, brow bone, eye bone, eye bone, brow bone, eyelid, crease, and accent. So, I mean, if you don't really know how to blend colors, you're not sure what types of look would, looks would look good together, find a palette like this. There are many of them that have them the colors labeled and just put them on as labeled and they'll blend together very nicely so if you don't know what colors to blend. so. But I think that I thought that these colors were so nice together and lately I've been really liking purple so yeah, 
I'm excited to use this. And of course, we have to have some of these. Mmm. These things are heaven. Alright, so I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. Make sure to thumbs up if you liked it. And comment down below. I really want to know, do you guys want me to do a makeup collection video? Because I'm actually accruing a lot of makeup recently. So I have a lot of different types of makeup. And I'd like to show you how I organize it. But I'm not sure if you guys want to see it. So comment down below if you would really like to see a makeup collection or comment down below any other video suggestions that you guys have for me and I totally any type of suggestion that I get I totally take into consideration and I always do a video for it so uh, comment down below with that follow me on all my social media links I'm on Instagram Twitter should be on Facebook soon um, what is the other one tumblr and Pinterest and vine I forgot to say that in my last video, but I'm also on Vine, so go follow me on all of my little social media so you can see me all off side. I was going to say off side of YouTube. Outside of YouTube, and we can hang out. So I will see you guys soon. Stay beautiful, and bye.